Have you ever wanted to create your very own cartoon characters but thought it was too hard or required fancy software? Well, forget that stress. With Canva, it's easy as dragging and dropping and having a little bit of fun. In this easy Canva tutorial, I'm going to show you how to design amazing cartoon characters in just a few clicks. No artistic skills needed. Stick around. Let's jump into Canva and let's get creative together. So here on Canva, we'll be using a video template. This is our canvas we'll be designing with. Here is where we'll focus on. We'll focus on the elements tab. I want to search for cartoon person. In my last video, I got this question on how I created my characters, the minimalistic characters I used in the intro of my video at the Bees lyrics. I hope you're listening and I hope you're watching. I hope you get value from this video. And I came over to where it says graphics and I sort out the graphics by animated. This was one of the characters I used. I dropped that on the canvas. You either use the magic recommendation to find more characters. Let's open that up. These are more characters under the magic recommendation. And if you see all of them have the crown here, meaning that they are pro features. Not that you cannot find a free feature, you can find ones that are free. But if you have a pro account, you should be able to use the pro feature. Or you can sign up with my link in the description. There's a link in the description to sign up for Canva Pro. You get 30 days free trial with that link. So these are all characters I recommended when I use the magic recommendation. What if we go back and I click on these three dots? See more like this. It also opens more characters for you to choose from. If you click on the characters, some of them are customizable, some of them are not. Let's add another page. Let's open this up. The goal is to find a character. We have two characters on this page. You know this kind of story you want to tell. You decide what characters you want to use. I'll go ahead and delete this one. This one's mouth is moving a bit, but it's a male character. So I'm going to take this one out. So it's one of the characters I use. It came as a cutout. So what I did was to go get a background. Before we do that, let me come to the first page. The mouth is moving, so if you're talking, it's going to appear as if you lip synced it. But there was no lip syncing that happened. These are just free illustrated characters in Canva that you can freely use. This is also a male character, so I'm looking for a female that will feel more like me. Let me take this out. So you should be able to search the Canva library and find what it is you're looking for. I kind of like this character. Let me check this. I'm going to quickly add new page. I like this one. This is free to use. And let's see. Are they more like this? This came in a collection. I like this. Let's see the collection. Wow. So you see these ones, their mouths are not moving, but they are wondering which does what it is I want to do. Once you find the characters it is you're looking for. The next thing is to choose the background. So I'm going to go ahead and search for cartoon office background. So you go back to graphics. We want to search all this to find one that is suiting for our character. So finally found the background that works. It appears as if she's sitting down. But let me go over to this one. Let's find a background for this. And when I set the image as background, it appeared as if she was sitting across the other side of the table. One thing I did was to take her to this part. She went away from this bulb that was here. So you just have to build your character properly. If you notice her mouth was moving and it matched with what it is I was saying and I added the text that appeared to her hand here. Yeah. I did that with cap cords. But you can also add it here. Let's come over here. This background seems to be busy for this character. So we're going to search for a background that will contrast that. This one seems as if it will work. Let's set it as background. You can decide to build uh, out 
So you look, we have our first page, we have our second page, we have our third page. You can also add some other things like in my last video, I added a bubble. Let's add text bubble. Let's go to graphics. Animated. Let's use this one. This is a pro feature, but you can find free features you can use if you're not able to afford the pro feature. But you can just subscribe for the pro using my link in the description. Mind you, that's an affiliate link, but you don't get charged for anything. So I'm going to quickly position this to uh -huh. with this. I can add my text. Either I click here on your keyboard or you click here. Let's go back to position, select this, and select the second one, and let's group. With this, we can come over to this three dots, your timing. You can decide for how long it's going to come out. You see that? Let's add on that page. Another cool keyword you can search for, let's go back to element, is illustrated characters. And this time, we will not be using the graphics, we will be going to video. If you scroll down, there are a bunch of elements you can put into your design that will fit into whatever it is you're making. Let's pick this one for example. Now we want to make it as our background. Let me close this out so we have more space to edit with. Let's preview the video and let's see. Yeah, if you want to go a step further, you can come over to where it says playback and increase the video speed. That way it automatically reduces it for you. I'm going to go ahead and edit this. Trim out the part I want. Yeah, if you'll be editing in Canva, you can quickly just download your videos as single videos and import them back in. You can work on this because there are various elements on it if you want to increase or reduce the playback speed. So I advise you export your video and import it back in. I've gone ahead and added a bunch of cool illustrated videos to this file. I'll be leaving the link in the description box to the template. Please check it out if you want to go through the template file I use. So with this, you're able to build your illustrated characters. You can use the search terms, illustrated characters. You can use the search word cartoon person where you just pull in your characters together put in element put in the background and the characters are already lip synced and it will appear as if they are talking to your video that builds lyrics i hope i answered the question for you sincerely i hope i did answer your question but this is how to maximize the tools that are already available in canva if you don't have the canva pro you can use the Canva free. What you just need to search for elements that are free. Let me know what you think in the comment section. You can use this to build a whole video, but it's going to take you time. I must tell you that to search out these characters and place them how you want it. So yeah, subscribe to the channel for more videos like this. Do have a good one.